I'm making a sugar scrub and I'm using my own liquid silk paste to make this and I love the texture you know hi there everyone it's been a while since I've made any videos so I will be making a face scrub in a different way um, this is my um, soap, liquid soap, that I made from scratch. I've got some shea butter here, uh, essential oils. This is blood orange. I love the smell of blood orange. This is for, this is the peppermint, and that helps rejuvenate my dead cells on my face, and lemongrass. And I have some mental crystal. This is for my face, guys. My face is in distress. So I'm gonna get this melted and I will bring you guys back in a minute. In a minute. Okay, so I have my shea butter melted and uh, uh, Alright guys, it's like two, two, what time is it? I don't even know what time it is. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna put some oh, mental crystal in the why is this thing so funky? Okay, let me I'm gonna get a tiny little bit not much because it's from my face. It's not the you know. I'm throwing it. <laughs> I'm throwing it over the place. So, oh, it smells so good. Just a tiny little bit, and it smells ruby. Okay. Okay, so. Dropper for the blood orange. Okay. And uh, let's get this one here. Peppermint. To throw this out. I'm using essential oils, guys, because I don't want to use fragrance for my face unless it's suitable. Tickens up really fast, I think, from the essential oils can thicken up your paste. I'm gonna put a bit of um, I'll put a bit of green, or just leave it this color. Let me think about it. Let me think about it. This is a this face is mine. <laughs> Oh, it's going to have such a good time on my face. Scrubby, rubby, rubby. Okay. Okay, so I'm back. I'm back. I would like to add a bit of green. I can smell 
got lemongrass. It can smell that lemongrass. Okay, hang on. Oh, go on. Oh. I can move that out of my way. Clean this up a bit. in a long time and I'm using this dye um, I have to I had to um, basically heat up some distilled water to break down the powder and this dye I'm using um, I'm using is from Gail and um, her dyes are pretty strong. You don't need a whole lot. I think I have enough green now. I don't need any more green. Yep. So this is what my face is in need of. So this is a totally different way to make sugar scrubs, in this case facial scrub. I am using my soap, liquid soap, to make, and there's a lot of uh, shea butter in there and, you know, all good stuff. And I make my sh my um, liquid soap with, I use coconut oil, olive oil, and some other oil. Canola oil, yeah. I mean, I love making formulas, doing different things. And um, yeah, so the salmon grass smells really, really strong. And I smell a little bit of the peppermint, which is perfect. Okay, so I'm using regular sugar, white sugar. And you have to do this when it's cool because if you put your sugar in while it's hot it will melt so you have to let this cool down to room temperature before you add your sugar to be too abrasive on my skin. Yeah. I've seen sugar scrubs in the store and they're like it's so slurpy like <laughs> like it's very liquidy I can put this in a, <clears throat> a tube <clears throat> like the lotion tubes <clears throat> but I don't have any such This is the only good thing sugar is for. 
We need to lay off the sugar food. Oh my gosh. Lay off. Lay off. And then I finish this off. I only do that because it has like a little bit of lumps, which I should have gotten rid of before. And this is not going to be oily and, you know, some sugar scrubs, people make it with just oil. I'll bring it back in a minute. Okay, so I have to remember to add my Optifin, which is a preservative. You must, 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 because you know it goes into your bathroom and you don't want a moldy product. So there. Sorry, Optifin with this. Oh my God. I just tested it on my elbow. Oh my god, that's so nice and silky. Nice and silky. Okay, I'll be back to pour it into my containers. Okay. Time to fill up, fill up, fill up. Time to fill it up, fill it up. I get these stupid gloves on. Guys, you will not believe what time it is that I'm making this stuff. Okay. All right. So, yeah. I have these cute little containers that I got from Amazon. This color and this is lemongrass has a has a green color if you look at the plant green color in my bird country when I was a kid in Guyana G-U-Y-A-N-A -A, we had a lemongrass plant right down the stairs and we go pick pick the plant and boil it up and make tea my grandmother my grandmother, <laughs> she makes the tea, and it's so good. I tell you, love it, love it, love it for my was a kid. Lemongrass. Well, that is done. I shall pour some more, but I don't want to bore you. See you next time. Stay safe. <laughs>